Well, thanks to Martin for the first few races from York. I'll take the last in York before heading for Ascot. It's a two-mile handicap, a 0 90 gap for three L's. One is Slotty Barfoss, Patrick Hogan. Two, Ray Ross, David Robertson. Three is the funny Bell, Graham Clatterback. And four is Heesh and Duchess, Vinnie Jow, the leading trainer on wins at the moment and just behind Craig Beckwith on prize money. It's a slotty bar for us to get a good break. He goes off the lead from Ray Ross, but they've been Ray and Sponic Bell. But it's a Haitian Duchess who's now moved up onto the outside of Slotty Bar Fast. And as they pass the crowds and the wooden post for the first time, and it's Haitian Duchess as they head out on the final circuit who leads from Slotty Bar Fast in second. Then comes Ray Ross for David Robertson and Zephonic Bell for Graham Clutterbuck who had a lot of good saves last season and seems to have a few this season as well at the back of the field. So he's and Duchess in those green colours of Vinnie Gerrard. Well clear on wins at the top of the table at the moment. Ray Ross, David Robertson, also a lot of wins this season. Uh, just beyond that slanty bar for for Patrick Hogan and Zephonic Bell for Graham Clutterbuck is back in fourth place. Four horses in this two mile handicap and a siege and duchess in those green colours of Vinnie Gerard the leader from Ray Ross for David Robertson as distinctive turquoise and pink colours with a yellow cap in between horses the yellow colours of the black season black cap that's a slanty bar for of Patrick Hogan and the Welsh fire colours of Zephonic Bell for Graham Clutterbuck is just ahead of that now 10 photos left to travel, Heesh and Dutch is the lever from Ray Ross in second, Zephonic Bell for Graham Clutterbuck just behind that and then comes Slotty Bardfast for Patrick Ogan who looks on from the rear of the field with about 9 photos left to travel and Heesh and Duchess well clear at this stage from Zephonic Bell in second for Graham Clutterbuck, Ray Ross is just behind that with on his outside Slotty Bardfast, 4 horses separated by about 8 lengths as a uh, Eastern Duchess takes him along. Three lanes clear of Zephonic Bell in second. Then comes Ray Ross travelling well in third and Slotty Bartfoss looks on from the rear. I also came from the rear last time. It's Eastern Duchess in those green colours the leads from Zephonic Bell in second about three lanes back. Then comes Ray Ross for David Robertson and Slotty Bartfoss at the back of the field. Six and a half hours left to travel and Vinnie Gerald's Heesh and Duchess travelling comfortably in front. The black horse is clear from Zephonic Bell in second. Then the David Robertson horse Ray Ross is on the inside of the Slarty Bart Fast. As they approach the home stretch, the Vinnie Gerald's Heesh and Duchess not so far clear now, only two lengths clear of a Zephonic Bell. Ray Ross a further three lengths behind that and then comes the Slarty Bart Fast. So Heesh and Duchess tries to kick from the front here with four lengths left to travel. Heesh and Duchess has gone five or six lengths clear from Zephonic Bell in second. Ray Ross is running on strongly. Also Slarty Bart Fast is trying to get going. It's still Heesh and Duchess clear with three lengths left to travel. Ray Ross is joining Zephonic Bell for second. Then comes Slarty Bart Fast. They've got two and a half furlongs left to go and Heesh and Duchess is still clear but Ray Ross is first to try to finish very strongly up on the outside of a Zephonic Bell. Slarty Bart Fast is also running on. It's Heesh and Duchess but yeah comes Ray Ross for David Robertson. They've got a full and a half to go. Heesh and Dutch is trying to hold on, but uh, Ray Ross is finishing strongly for David Robertson. It's only a matter of time before Ray Ross gets up to join Heesh and Duchess. It's Heesh and Duchess in front, but here comes Ray Ross. And Ray Ross comes up to join Heesh and Duchess. Now it's Hardy Barfoss in the answer. It's a funny bell running on. But Ray Ross has gone to the front for David Robertson. And Ray Ross is going to win the two mile handicap at York from Safani Bell in second. Slotty Barfoss probably up third. And Heesh and Duchess has faded out of it. To finish fourth. So David Robertson picks up another winner. He's been going great guns this season. Wins comfortably from Zephonic Bell in second. I think Slanty Barfoss probably got third. And a long time leader, Heesh and Duchess, finished back in fourth.